The Secondi High Court has cleared the National Democratic Congress candidates for a Memphis Central, Joanna Jan Kujo, to contest in the December 7 parliamentary elections after setting aside an earlier injunction. Joanna Jan Kujo had earlier been barred from holding herself as a parliamentary candidate by the court. The Accra High Court last Thursday had dismissed an application by the NDC that sought to restrain the Electoral Commission from printing the notice of polls and ballot papers for Amenfi Central. The NDC wanted the court to stop the EC from printing the ballot papers pending the final determination of its suit, challenging the Commission's decision not to recognize Joanna Jan Kujo as the duly elected NDC candidate for Amenfi Central. At the Second D High Court on Monday, Lead Counsel for Joanna Kujo, Edujita Maklo urged the court to consider the substantive disqualification case, noting that any further delay could disenfranchise his client and prevent her from participating in the December 7 parliamentary elections. Presiding Judge Jan Konto agreed to review the substantive case and advised the parties to consider an out-of-court settlement before the scheduled hearing. They, however, couldn't do so. An elated Amenfi Central parliamentary candidate spoke after she was cleared to contest. I thank God and all the NDC members in Amenfi Central, branch executives, conscience executives, are coming home and we are going to do our campaign lunch. And after the campaign lunch, then they are going to do our campaign lunch. So I know that the people are waiting for me and they are happy. So I want to tell them that they should just go and find something to eat and drink and be happy and town God. Her lawyer, Edwige Tamaklo, urged the Electoral Commission to heed to the directive of the court. The Electoral Commission rep is in court. He is aware the court has vacated the injunction. The basis on which they disqualify Joanna Jan is based on the injunction order. Now that the injunction has been vacated, Jen Mensah should do the right thing. <laughs> Right, so let's stay on this subject. Uh, joining us on phone now is counsel for the uh, Memphis Central Parliamentary Candidate and NDC's Director of Legal Affairs, uh, Duji Tamaklo. Mr. Tamaklo, thank you for your time. Uh, to start with, uh, many will be interested to know, looking at how this case has traveled, what was exactly your argument that managed to get the court to rule in your favor? Okay, uh, am I talking to my brother, Date? Yes, this is Martin. Martin, okay, so Martin, uh, once again, uh, good evening to your viewers. I want to start first by thanking um, the presiding judge. I'm exceedingly grateful that today, when the prayer was made, he graciously gave attention to it, and at the end of the day, find merit uh, in the arguments that were made and therefore decided to grant the application. We are exceedingly grateful to him. We are grateful to the court. Now that said, um, as you rightly pointed out, and the insert you played, our resolve and our prayer is that the electoral commission will act timely in getting Madame Joanna Ujojan restored onto the voters, uh, uh, I mean, the notice of poll and the, uh, 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 the ballot paper immediately. Mm. Remember that we have only 26 days um, to the election. We are committed, and I hear I urge the rank and file of our party in Amenfi Centra to get ready. We are all going to come down. Mm. to get to the various communities to work than never before. This is a seat that from 1992 we have never lost. Right. I have no doubt at all in my mind that with the support of the Almighty God and the support of the constituency executives, the rank and file of our party, the regional executive with our national executive, we will maintain that seat. Right. And, and Mr. Tamaklo, right, so um, have you formally, uh, so maybe let's t stay in the courts, did the uh, representative of the Electoral Commission, did they, were, no. were they uh, in court? Like, like, I, like I pointed out earlier, there was a rep of the Electoral Commission okay. in court today. When the case was called, 
a gentleman stood up and indicated that he's the one representing the electoral commission. Mm. In any case, we have taken formal steps to procure copies of the other, which we are hopeful by close of day tomorrow. By, I mean, even tomorrow afternoon, uh, we should get the order. In fact, I stayed, after court, I stayed to ensure that the order was properly um, typed and everything. Right. We expect that my Lord will go through, and once everything is correct, we would have it procured and immediately serve the letter commission. We do okay. not have the benefit of time. Mm. Okay. Right. Mr. Samaklo, thank you for those quick updates. Uh, we would have to leave it That's here for I now. I appreciate, I appreciate the opportunity. Right. And so we've been speaking to Eduji Tamaklo, who is the director of... Um, Legal Affairs for the National Democratic Congress. We'll see how the campaign activities now change or turn up in the constituency. You're still watching TV3. This is News 360.